It is spring, and spring is a time for one of my most favorite art lessons, uh, Japanese cherry blossoms. So first we'll look at some pictures to get inspiration, and then I'll show you how to make your own. So on Google, I just searched cherry blossom art, and went to images, and um, all these great pictures came up. You can see a lot of them are very simple, just a white background, those black lines, um, and then the the pink blossoms. Um, if for older grades, if you want to make it a little more um, in depth, you could add some sky and moon in the background or mountains. This one has Mount Fuji, a very famous mountain in Japan on there. Um, so more ideas for you to um, incorporate into your artwork. So for materials, you'll need paint. You can use acrylic, watercolor, tempera. You'll need water, some brushes. Um, you will need a straw. You can use a regular plastic drinking straw. One from a, you can use paper straws. You can use metal or bamboo straws. Um, if you use a thicker paint, you wanna make sure you mix it with water. You're gonna need the black to be really, really, um, uh, wet and drippy because you're gonna, the next step is you're gonna be dripping it onto the paper. So you really wanna get it nice and wet. And then just along the bottom of the paper, you wanna put some big drops straight along the bottom there. And then you're gonna grab your straw and uh, you want to point it in the direction you want the paint to go. So starting at the bottom of the paper, you're pointing it up toward the top of the paper. It's almost flat against the paper, and I'm wiggling it back and forth there to get it a little more branches and stuff. Then you're going to take some red or white or pink, or all three, dip your little pinky finger, just the pinky finger, into the paint, and add some little groups of dots. So I made some little groups of three, and I'm just adding some little blossoms all over the page. Don't forget to clean up. So that's it. Don't forget to sign your artwork and take pictures and email them to me and I can share them on our Instagram and our website. See you next week.